So in one of the blog posts that you've published, you mentioned that GraphQL will likely be the preferred query language and database uh, of the decentralized web. What did you mean by that? And why do you think that is the case? GraphQL has been rising uh, in popularity just in traditional web development. There's a lot of companies like you know GitHub and Twitter and Yelp and, and, and many others that you know have already switched to GraphQL. And so th this is already a, a really big trend happening in web development generally. And really what, what you need when you're building applications is essentially a, like a, a standard for uh, how you want to access your data. And um, you basically need an abstraction. And, and you know, we believe that GraphQL basically is just the right level for this sort of abstraction. You don't want to have to know what block some data was updated in and all of the like internals of a blockchain if you're trying to build an application. And so having an abstraction on top that is just the data model is, we think, the right level for how people will choose to build their apps. And then you can deal with all of the implementation details um, on the backside of that GraphQL API.